This is problem number 11, uh, which is a simply supported beam. Uh, but this, this confuses people a lot because it has an applied moment of 50 kilonewton meters on it. Now, the, the moment is acting clockwise, which is important, uh, and it is shown acting at 6.5 meters from the left-hand side. Um, the first thing we have to do is uh, the reactions uh, using equilibrium equations. Now, when you do the reactions, you got to take into account this 50 kilonewton meter applied moment. Uh, you take it into account in the moment equation, not the force equation, the moment equation, and it doesn't have a distance associated with it because it's already a moment. When you do the reactions, you should find that the left-hand reaction is 4.8 kilonewtons, and the right-hand reaction is 9.2 kilonewtons. Once you have those reactions, you proceed with the shear diagram the way that we've always done. Again, the 50 kilonewton meter applied moment doesn't show up in the shear diagram because the shear diagram is all about forces. So your shear diagram would look something like this. Left-hand reaction brings you up to 4.8 kilonewtons. Uh, nothing goes on until you hit the 14 kilonewton concentrated load that brings you down to negative 9.2. Nothing happens until you hit the last force, which is the right-hand reaction. The uh, areas under the shear diagram would be the first area would be positive 14.4 kilonewton meters. Uh, you'll notice that the big rectangle that's below zero, I've divided up uh, into two sections just because one section is before the moment is applied and the next section is after. Both of those sections are negative 32.2 kilonewton meters. Okay, so the moment diagram ends up looking like this. It's all, uh, all the areas under a shear diagram are rectangular. So you go from 0 up to 14.4, then you go from that point downward on a straight line down to negative 17.8, and then here's where the applied moment, the positive 50 kilonewton meters, brings you directly up to positive 32.2, and then the last area of negative 32.2 brings you back down to 0.